Welcome back to New Day Cleveland. He is a Grammy nominated member of the Grand Old Opry, a television personality and just an all out outstanding guy. That's for sure. I'm talking about country music star Trace Atkins, and I recently had the opportunity to sit down with him. It was a little intimidating at first, uh, but take a look. It is not often that I get a treat like this at the WJR studios. I have a country living legend sitting here with me today, Trace Adkins. He's not going to take it, but I'm telling you, I mean, it's just, it's remarkable to have you in here to listen to some of your new music. You have been working in the business for quite some time. You're on your 13th album. That's it's remarkable. That. How do you do that? Did you say you didn't know that? <laughs> I, I, I remember when I put out the 10 album, uh, because we called it 10, because it was 10th, but I don't, I haven't been keeping up with it, so. Oh, yeah, 13, cool. It's amazing. Well, I'm glad I got to inform you of that. All right. So you've been doing this then for a while. You've been around. I, In my opinion, I love country music, and I feel like over maybe the last two decades, it's really, it's transformed itself in a way. Do you do you feel the same, and how do you feel like you've, trans your music has transformed? You know, I know when I came along and, and I, and I came out with the Thinking Thing video and, you know, a lot of the purists were offended and all, you know, uh, it's, it's always been like that. Uh, and my stuff is just, um, I don't know that I've really changed that much. I think I've gotten better, you know, I think I've, I think my chops have gotten better. I think I sing better um, than I did when I first came out and I was green, but. Uh, I could listen to his voice for hours. It's just, it's you have an incredible, incredible voice. I want to talk about your new single that's that's going to be out in January, Jesus and Jones. Do you find yourself, I, I like the dichotomy of this song, do you find yourself in your day-to-day -day life kind of living in that situation? Yeah, it's, it's, you know, I'm a, I'm, I'm, I think I'm a good man, but you know, sometimes I'm, I'm a bad boy and that's kind of the whole good. Jesus and Jones thing, you know, it's like, because I grew up, the first thing I ever did in front of a microphone, I was singing bass in a gospel quartet, and I did that for a few years. And 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 then, you know, uh, I found myself singing George Jones songs in a beer joint at some point, and so then you have to kind of, okay, how did this happen? You know, how did I go from this to this, and where do I belong? Is it somewhere in the middle? or how? So, and, you know, that's kind of what the song talks about. Soldier, another song that's remarkable, and I have a feeling that has special meaning to you. Well, uh, I've been working with Wounded Warrior Project for many years, and um, and they've started this new long-term trust program uh, because a lot of these guys are going to need care for the rest of their lives. I mean, and some of them, they're caregivers who are they're probably their parents. At some point, they won't be able to, to take care of these guys anymore. So the Wounded Warrior is setting up a long-term trust, and Soldier just kind of talks about a guy's transition after he comes home and gets back into, you know, normal life. I'm sure they're so incredibly thankful to have someone like you backing and supporting that as well. I want to switch gears a little bit because, I, you know, your album has a lot to it, and uh, there's a particular song on there that definitely seems to be a sexier song. Would you consider yourself a sexy man? No. <laughs> no. I mean, you like writing those I mean, I loved Honky Tonk but Honk and Honk, and I still thought that was kind of a sexy song too. Yeah. Sexy funny, you know, I had a guy tell me one time, he goes, you only do two things well, you do sappy daddy and sexy funny. That's it. Those are the two kind of songs that you do well. Sappy daddy, sexy funny. Which I think sexy funny gets you sappy daddy. It's, you know it's what I mean? True, it's true. But anyway. It's all one uh, big circle. <laughs> So what were we talking about? No, you, just threw, at, you threw me you off there. Him, me too. Sexy. I'm flustered. Look, am I am I red? I'm clear. Wait, I just did. Uh, I make him blush. I love this. <laughs> so, but you're gonna miss this. That's another one. Oh, so what, you what's, like oh, that, you were talking combo. about? Oh yeah, uh, you were talking about uh, something's going on. Something's going on. Yeah, there's some there's some nasty songs on this album, but I always do that. I mean, I I do Sappy Daddy, and then I do you know a patriotic thing, and then nasty, and just I don't know. I, I I never have really zeroed in on anything that I should be doing. I just put a lot of different stuff on my records. And well, I think that speaks to your to your personal life too and everything you do. I mean, you're a man of so many talents. We've seen you 
on shows. We've seen you in the movies. You're an amazing singer. So you're just a, a talented human being that uh, we are just appreciative to have listening on the radio, too. That's Bless for sure. Your heart. Thank you. Thank you. Trace Atkins, a pleasure to meet you, sir. Pleasure was thank mine. You. Thank you. True cowboy right here. That's <laughs> for sure. Thank you, Jesus and John. I saw you make him smile. I had to warm him up a bit. <laughs> I, and I think once I started asking him if he felt sexy at all because he sings these songs, then he, he, he blushed. His yeah. cheeks got red. I was like, I got him. I said, got yeah. him. <laughs> Man, what a big voice. Amazing voice. Yeah. And when you get to know him and he knows that you actually are caring about talking to him about things that matter to him, he just opens up and he is just, he's a, he's a big ball of mush. He's like a sappy daddy, like you said. Really? He's a wonderful guy. Sappy daddy.